Today I'm going to make Jacob's Ladder using an old neon sign transformer. Jacob's Ladder is a high voltage source connected to two electrodes arranged in a V, where they are separated by a few millimeters at the bottom and gradually diverge. I'm using an old neon transformer that produces 9000 volts at 30 milliamps. For the output electrodes, I have some leftover 10 gauge copper wire from another project. The transformer's primary side has two input terminals for 120 volt line and neutral, and there's two secondary output terminals for the 9000 volts. The way Jacob's Ladder works has to do with the ability of high voltage to break down and ionize the air between the electrodes. Depending on factors like humidity, it'll take about 3000 volts to break down the air for every millimeter of distance between those electrodes. So for my 9000 volt transformer, I should be able to get an arc between the electrodes if they're about 3 millimeters apart at the bottom. Once an arc forms through the plasma, which is the path of least resistance between the electrodes, the plasma is heated. The plasma is also less dense than the non-ionized air around it, and this causes the conduction path to rise, carrying the arc upwards with it. When the space between the electrodes is too much to sustain the arc, the circuit is broken and a new arc begins at the bottom where the electrodes are close enough to ionize the air all over again. When it's in operation, the high voltage arc can start fires, so let's try and light a candle with it. And that's how easy it is to start a fire. So treat high voltage with caution.